Okay, we're back again to learn more about adjectives and nouns. So adjectives describe nouns and a fun game that children love to play is doing the um, adjective noun game. So I have several iterations of it. In my classroom, I have boxes. It's like a big tool toolbox, but I've used it as a grammar box. So we have the adjective noun game one, two, and three. And the nice thing about this is that children can make silly combinations. So we have all these adjectives and we match them up to their, to what they think would make sense. Okay. So first we lay out the nouns, and these are all CVC words. They're all three-letter words, so that's why it's box one, because it's easy to read, and my beginning readers can do this. So I've got, let's see, we've got cap, pan, dog, bug, bed, man. I'm going to start Moving it over here. In fact, I might take this out of the easel so that I can actually move it around. And we've got pig and fox. I need another. There we go. All right. Now we get to have fun making silly combinations. Make this a little bit more symmetrical. Okay, the first one I come across is tin. Well, my brain immediately thinks tin man. <laughs> but it could be tin cup, right? Or a tin pan, maybe? Probably not a tin bug or a tin bed or a tin sun, that wouldn't make any sense, right? Well, let's put it here for Tin Man. We might move it later, but that's okay. Sad. Well, gosh. We could have a sad dog. We could have a sad bug. A sad bed. I don't think beds have feelings. A sad sun. <laughs> sad pig. A sad fox. Hmm. Maybe the fox is sad. He couldn't get into the hen house. How about big, big bed. I love to sleep in a big bed. Hot, well, what makes sense? We could do a hot dog <laughs> or a hot sun. I think I'll put hot sun. Fat, hmm. Well, you could put fat pig. That would work. Hmm. How about wet? Well, when I see the word wet, I think of a wet dog. When I used to take my dogs on walks on the trail, they always wanted to jump into the pond. And then I had two wet dogs. Hmm, what about a red, hmm, we could have a red bug, ladybugs are red, a red bug. What about an old cap? My husband likes to wear an old baseball cap. Hmm. Now I have these three adjectives left and none of them seem to describe a pan, but we could say, oh, don't use that pan. It's the bad pan. It always burns everything. <laughs> so that's the adjective noun game and that's box one. So all these words are very easy to spell and easy to read. 
but children get a kick out of mixing them all up and doing silly things like the fat son, they'll get a giggle, the hot pig, <laughs> fun things like that. Okay, next I'll do box two.